Welcome back, dear friends. Today's adventure takes me to pick up my son from college. At least the weather is beautiful. It's 38 degrees, clear skies. It really doesn't feel too, too cold outside. Thankfully, no snow or rain, so driving conditions are a-okay. Bit of a drive in front of me. And on my drive, I am going to catch up on Monashak's Russian YouTube videos from her trip to Armenia because I'm so busy with life, finishing up the semester, making my own English videos, taking care of my, my younger son, that I have not had time to catch up on her trip. And I've hardly seen her since she's returned, so I thought this will be a good opportunity for me to listen, not watch, to listen to her videos while I'm driving. Because sometimes that's the only way both of us, even though we live next door and we're best friends, sometimes it's the only way that we get caught up on each other's lives, ironically enough, is by watching each other's videos. But just kind of enjoy my alone time my, my little amount of alone time uh, where I don't have any distractions other than the road ahead of me. And I am so looking forward to seeing him and I am so looking forward to catching up with him and I am grateful for the chunk of time that we'll have together in the car because both of us can get caught up with each other. So join me on today's adventure. All right, I'm halfway to my destination to get my son. He's already called me and said, I'm done with finals. I said, you weren't supposed to be done till 2.30. I was like, oh my gosh, I can't stand. I want to leave. I said, hey, I feel lucky that I got to come get you in the first place. I will be there shortly. I had to fuel up on coffee because the, the road was getting long for me and I'm tired today. I can't wait to see my son. It's always, always, always so nice to see your children when they've been away for a while. Even when they're not away, it's always nice to see them. He had his last final exam for this fall semester, so he has successfully completed his first semester in college. I am extremely proud of him, and I am wishing him and his friends all the best for their future college classes and careers and much success. So as I was driving, I was thinking about uh, Monoshock and my progression on YouTube. And I think back to the first videos we've made and I think, oh my goodness, they're probably so slow or so elementary. I was listening to Nick Nimmin, a YouTuber, as I was driving, I was listening to him because he teaches individuals how to get on YouTube, how to be successful on YouTube, and he made some really good points. He said, first of all, you have to start somewhere. So yes, we did start. We took that plunge in October, November of 2020. We started. He said, you learn as you edit through your videos, you work through your videos, you start to see what works, you start to see what makes sense, what fits together. Our goal with our YouTube channel is to provide positivity, to help people give ideas, listen to ideas, show interesting adventures that we take, like at home, but also when we travel, because we both, Monoshock and I, love to travel. We're very grateful if you are with us. We're so thankful. We know that time, people's time and energy is valuable. So thank you so much for being with us. If you are with us, we are eternally grateful. The holidays are coming up next week. It's hard to believe. It's always hard to believe. It always kind of hits me out of nowhere. Am I ready for the holidays? Absolutely not. Nowhere near. I don't even have a Christmas tree up. It's still sitting in my basement. I have not had time because I've been playing catch up 
and repair with my hot water heater situation. So let's continue on this trip to get my son. This feels like the never ending story of the trip. It's not that far, but somehow this is feeling like a very long travel and I still have to go back, but I can have my son drive part of the way. Oh. There was nobody in here before I filmed. I made sure of that. And I feel like I am in my elementary school bathroom decades back. That's how old this bathroom feels to me. Oh my goodness gracious. This is an example of what the woman's bathroom slash dorm showers look like. And now we're headed home. Got dark, cooled off. Thank you so much for being with us. We're wishing you a happy holidays and we'll see you for the next adventure. Much love. Take care. Bye bye.